PD's gonna go talk to them. They Ignat found in the pot jacket pocket of one of the girls like a cell phone, iPhone six. When they open up the screen, there's like a Asian family on there, so we probably have other victims. Cool. <laughs> um, I gotta bring the public defender back first. So. I'm sure. We, do, do you record that or no? It's not admissible, but I, re I record it. What if he decides to molest them in there? <laughs> then we're on the hook. So. Hey. Yeah. Hey, you know, it would be a good idea, though, and I think I talked to you about it. I might talk to, I think I talked to, it was either you or Dave, maybe getting a phone line installed in there so we could plug it in so they could talk to them over the phone instead of having to come down here. Because when we use our cell phones, they don't dial out. But why do we have to? We have to provide them the ability to talk to them, and that way we don't have to take them out of the interview room. How is, it, how is, that, not, how is, that, how is that not privileged information? Well, it is, but like it just doesn't get admissible. <laughs> like when we record it, it just it's just not admissible. We don't have to record the phone call. Just uh, we're record. Well, I mean, what? Right. You know what I mean? Like uh, when we've tried to let them co talk, co when like we did it. Sometimes a public defender won't come in. They will say, "Oh, I'm at home already." Mm -hmm. So can you just put them on the phone? And then the phone yeah. we have to make like 45 phone calls. But if we just had something like a old desk phone like that, and run a wire, and then they could just talk to them on the phone. And we'd still record, but it's it, it's something. It's not. Is there, is there issues? Is there issues with recording? I mean, like, isn't that? Is it with what? Is there an issue with recording? Well, if we record, we just say that it was. Um, it's just something that they can't. It's not admissible. It's privileged there, so they'll edit the tape and like the, the from the time he was put in the room to the time he lawyered up. Uh, it was uh, whatever might have been recorded him talking. Whatever he might have said is just privileged, and it's. Not admissible in court. What if it led you to an investigation? Well, we, what we, hey, I put a gun in the fucking backyard. And you went back there and found the fucking gun. Well, that's that would they would probably make that the uh, inevitable discovery because we would the ask them. Rule? No, the, the in, 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 <laughs> inevitable discovery, which is the uh, if we have the public safety statement, we could ask them when after they've already lawyered up. Right. So, I what we've done is like what well, we've we've had this these recordings. We have not yet listened to any of the recordings with what they said to the attorney. We just uh, start go out to, to the part where we go in there and then they tell us to, <laughs> my lawyer says not to talk to you and then we, <laughs> and that's it, so. All right, so you have a good, you have a good